It's your boy Meek Melly right here kicking it. The DJ No Frills. You know what it do, man. We going there. It's Meek Melly. Play, I got you. Famous Frills. DJ No Frills. Fish Street Radio. Down somewhere in Philly, man. Look, this is a special block. You can tell by the construction. You ain't never seen nothing like this. Yo, just Google it, man. It's a legendary block. And I'm down here with somebody that's legendary that if you don't know who he is, all you got to do is listen to Freeway, Cannon, and he says the name. Tell him the name, fam. I roll over your squad like I'm One Punch Card. You chops. Simon One Punch Card, Mr. Everywhere, where you never there. Why right. would I ever care? We live. So, man, what make, so what make you stay in Philly, man? Oh, man, the heritage. You know what I mean? The grind. The hustle and it remind me of, of the beginning, man. We got to go back to the beginning. Sometimes you got to start at the bottom and the ground right back to the top when we here. That's all fact. So what you think right far as like Philly, as far as the culture, is it safe to say yeah, that yeah, at yeah, Philadelphia, yeah. um, is it crabs in the barrel type of mentality here? Yes, yes, very. What you think that came from? Uh man, I just really just being oppressed for so long. We've been oppressed. Right. We've been down. Everybody been like and not having enough. So when we on top of each other, nobody don't have you know no type of resources and everything. So it is always like you know every time you stepping up, you feeling somebody pulling you right back down. So basically, it's safe to say it's not enough outlets in the no, city. No, no, and even the ones that do offer a resource, they all go. They leave the city. Like you know, uh, no no disrespect, Kevin Hart. You know. Eve, Will Smith, me, all of everyone that, that's really moving. And I understand it because you can't help everybody. It's draining. So it felt like you got to get your own line and you got to go and blow and then come back and then you can offer a resource. But if you just levitate, you can't get off the ground if you don't have no type of outlet. It ain't nothing. So is, is it safe to say like when you outside of Philly you get more love? Yes, very much so. So I, I mean that's that. one of all my places that say, say that. everywhere say when that. you never there it's I'm always a movement the, that of me going that. all over the world to get a different type of energy to see a different culture to see how you embrace it in a different way because outside of this you just only feel this. When I went to LA People were saying, yo, punch, yo, yo. And I'm like, who that? What's up? You know what I mean? Because outside our environment, if we don't know you, we, we can't flow you. It, it's just not going right. to happen. So when I went to Memphis, when I went to, you know, uh, Charlotte, when I get got to Atlanta, it was a different atmosphere. They always embraced me. They almost, they always showed love. And, you know. I felt it. So I how, knew what it was. So how did how did it make you feel when you when you when you feel that love like from outside? Make you wanna go harder. You yeah. go harder. You going hard. Everybody's going hard. Everybody pushing. Um and it's a different type of energy and vibe. We so, vibe. So when you so when you come back to Philly and I know and I say this for myself, people definitely know you and they respect you, you got a great name. But do you feel like not being entitled, I, I can say this for you, you are entitled because you put the work in. Sure. I feel like, for me, and I think I'm asking and telling the question at the same time, in Philadelphia, there's a lot of people that's entitled that didn't put the work in. Yeah. Where that come from, right. though? Is it the, is it the social media? It's what the is social it? media, and it's the buzz. But then, I mean, for, for guys like you and I, right. it's the second time around. It's the second...